So today is an exciting day. So today is an exciting day. We're getting the chickens out of the house and into the outside small coop so they can slowly get incorporated with the bigger chickens. And um, it's one of my favorite parts of this because then my house doesn't smell like baby chickens anymore. So we got it all set up. We got our heat pad plugged in and we, do, we are using a heat lamp this time. Um, we usually don't, but um, we have a ceramic bulb which is a lot safer than the glass ones. So let's get them put into their new into home. Their new home. Pretzel, I don't need your help here. So this breed is one that I'm super excited about. They have this beautiful feathering on the outside of the legs. It's a cuckoo marin. Um, I really got these because they have that dark brown eggs and they're really good layers. It's always kind of fun to play around with different breeds and kind of add them into the flock. So I'm really excited to see how this one does. It was sold to me as a hen, so hopefully it really is because it's 90% sex rate. So that means um, one out of 10 will be male, but hopefully we got the female here and I did get a couple of them. So we should have a couple of fun new colors to our flock. And I also like to add new chickens and different breeds to kind of play around with and what see what, what works best for us and which ones have the best egg laying production and also survival rate and are less maintenance to be real honest. So it's kind of one of those fun things to add and like I said it's got that really pretty feathering. So I'm going to be adding more pine to this coop here. Feels like we've been doing it a lot this year. Um, it's kind of been a never ending winter. As soon as you get a few nice days and you think it's almost spring, then another snowstorm hits and we get more and more snow. And now we've run out of places to put it. So we just have huge mounds everywhere. And I don't think there's been a year that I can remember that I have wanted spring any more than I want it this year. We've had too many teasers and too many snowstorms. And it's only the beginning of March, which is generally the snowiest month. So there's that to look forward to. So thanks for watching today and if you want to see more about our chickens, check out this video.